Yeah, well, I thought we started really well, and um, the, their goal came out, kind of out of nowhere. It was a set play, and um, until then they didn't have anything. And I thought we started off really well, which I was kind of surprised by because in uh, the beginning of the year they were really good when we played them. So we we started well, and then they got their goal out of nowhere. And I just wanted to encourage the guys to realize that we're actually the better team because we were the better team all game long. I mean, it was a big battle, but I thought we were better, so I, I told that to guys. I mean, to this point, definitely. You know, one of the greatest moments, I hope it's not the greatest moment, I hope uh, there's more to come in the future and uh, you know, we can keep on going and get a win at UCLA, so it's just about you know, taking the next step at this point. Well, it's never over till it's over and uh, a pretty resilient team and uh, you know, obviously uh, you know, I, thought, I thought we were the better soccer playing team, but uh, you know, sometimes the best team in soccer doesn't always win. And, and, uh, but we continued to play hard and, and uh, you know, uh, got the handball and, and that was uh, we knocked it in. And when we got the red card, I thought it was, uh, it was going to be tough for us. I thought we'd have to bunker in and defend. But, uh, hey, we got another PK. Toy made a gate run in the box and uh, split the two defenders and one of them had to pull him down. And Bala, <laughs> the game winner. I mean, I think it shows that we just don't give up. Uh, we had a similar kind of halftime talk when we when we won, won the conference two weeks ago at San Francisco. We were down 1-0 and we had to do the same thing. So at halftime, we talked about it. We're like, we can, we can come back. We did this two weeks ago to win the conference. We can do it again. And then obviously at the end of the day, I mean, we got lucky. I, th I thought it was a penalty, but it's it's a lucky play. But that's how, how playoffs are. It's so tight that one one little mistake can, can change the game. And that's what happened today. Because it's a lot of confidence, but uh, we know this is a completely different season. That was out of conference, and now it's uh, do or die. So um, they've seen us, we've seen them, so it has the makings of a great game. It's a, it's a two edged sword because they'll be waiting for us, and uh, they, they will be looking to beat us. And uh, obviously, we know that we can beat them because we've beaten them already this year, and so it's going to be tough. I can probably tell you they're not happy that they're, we're coming to, to UCLA. So we have a, a career playoff winning record against them in the tournament. So they, uh, I don't think there's too many teams that can, can boost that. So we're confident, but uh, not overconfident because any, any, anybody can win this game. It's, uh, it's a wide open game. Here he is, Miss Zombie with the right foot, and there it is! San Diego, the walk-off win at home! The Toreros in the 103rd minute tonight on their second PK of the evening have advanced to the second round in the NCAA tournament.